What's up, people? Welcome to the 12th WX Python tutorial. And this one's going to be real quick, so don't fall asleep or you might miss it. Um, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to build a checkbox. And you know, every one of you probably knows what a checkbox is, so I'm not going to have to explain it to you. But I am going to show you how to do it. And it's really easy and really simple. All you need to do is put WX in checkbox. Uh, the thing you need to watch out for probably is make sure the C and B are capitalized. And then you go ahead and write your parent, which is panel, in this case. And I have one for ID. And then you write what you want the value to be on that checkbox. So say we're building like, um, uh, let's build a grocery list where there's a bunch of items and you can click the ones you want. An online grocery store. How do you like that? Apples. How would you like getting apples sent through the mail? Not too good. Um, so after you put your item name, you go ahead and put the positioning. So I'm going to put mine in like 2020 or something like that. And then you go ahead and put the size in another tuple. And I'm going to put my 160 by negative 1 for default height. Um, and again, you just do this again and again for however many checkboxes you want. So let's go ahead and copy this. Um, and we should only need to change uh, the value. Let's change this one to tuna. And of course, we need to change the positioning of it so they don't overlap each other. And let's go ahead and create one more um, right there. So we have apples, tuna, and let's have roast beef. Only the best online grocery store for my customers. So 2040, we'll put this one at 2060 so they'll go from top down. And let me show you guys how this works. Run, run module, save this bad boy. Hopefully, I don't get any errors. Let me move this out of the way. And as you can see, we now have a checklist or checkbox that has apples, tuna, and roast beef. And as you can see, this is a checkbox where you can click any of these as you so desire. So that's pretty much the basics of your checkbox. And again, uh, the three things you have to remember here not three things, I don't even know why I said that Maybe because these are three things checkbox, make sure you have your capitalization right, um, don't forget the third one is the value and after that, don't forget to position them correctly so they don't overlap so that's a quick tutorial on how to build a checkbox don't know what I'm going to be teaching in the next tutorial, but it's going to be awesome so thank you guys for watching, don't forget to subscribe and I will see you next tutorial